Good night, everyone. Is it too, getting, yeah, it's like 10 o'clock at night, and I'm like watching Bob's Burgers here because I'm like so behind on a lot of the new episodes. Tomorrow, I like watching on Hulu. I watch this show and a few other shows on Hulu every once in a while. Whenever I let a bunch of new episodes build up, and then I watch them because I finished The Office and I have nothing to watch. I, I don't know what show I'm gonna start next. Um, if people commented on videos, I would ask them, what should I watch next, 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 I don't know. So, anyways, so today I was just thinking about it, or j just, um, before I started recording, I was like, wow, this is the 132nd video that I've done every single day since this year started, and, um, I just kind of want to talk about it, so, you know, the decision, I've talked about it tons of times I you know the decision I wanted to do this you know to help me out blah 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 and but there's like a lot that actually you know that comes with that as in um, getting the motivation to make sure you do it every single day um, I pledge to get videos out like before midnight or whatever but like sometimes I get them at like I get them up at like between one or four in the morning so Kind of like two videos in one day, but still I record every single day, which I count it. I count it. I don't know. I count it. Um, just because, you know, sometimes I'm not able to upload, you know, early, like today. I usually upload late at night. That's what I do because, you know, they're at the end of the day. But that's just one of those things that I let slip away, but um, I still have been good about getting it every single day. And then it's just been, it's been interesting because I it's forced me to do this every single day for 131 days or 32 now and uh, there's just it's a lot different than I thought like a lot of them are just this kind of stuff you know I'm either I was in I'm either in this spot or that spot right there or my chair or the bed or my car and I'm just talking about stuff um, that's what a majority of them have been but there have been a few that have been out and about and doing stuff and um, you know it's been it's a lot I've been getting more comfortable like filming all that stuff like yesterday's video was so much fun because I did a bunch of clips of everything I did and then now um, now me and Madison too can have these videos to go back on and actually watch and uh, remember those fun days because yesterday was a lot of fun um, so much fun it was amazing so um, it's great to be able to go back and remember those days, um, you know, because 365 days in a year, it's kind of hard to remember what you do every single day, but with this, I, I can, and it's nice, so um, definitely do that. I know during these 132 days, uh, there's a lot that I could have filmed that I've done, but I just didn't. I mean, do you really care that I go to eat, you know, I don't know. <laughs> But um, I don't care if you care. I care because I, I'm, I haven't. There's several videos that I watch, whenever I'm like feeling down or whatever. There's a few specific ones that I always go back and watch. Um, but I have yet to go and watch like every single one. I think that'd be a lot of fun to sit down and do a marathon. That'd be really cool. I wouldn't want to do it alone. I'd have to do it with someone. Or I couldn't do it with anyone. I have to do it alone because some of them are like. Uh, I even it's hard for me to even look at the thumbnails because some of the thumbnails like you know I'm just getting the sti the pre-made thumbnail that YouTube makes and uh, some of me and I'm like you know <laughs> or just <laughs> you know just really weird ones um, but yeah it's just it's been very it's been very interesting filming every single day like I don't think a lot of people could do it um, mainly because you know a lot of people don't do things to that they film every day, but I make an excuse and I do it. Um, some of them are 30 second long videos of me like laying down in my bed and being very tired or very sick, but I still get it up. Um, you know, one of them was just a candlelight. So, uh, what was some of the other ones? Um, I haven't done a mug vacation in a while. <laughs> Uh, that was fun. I have still have a bunch of videos that I could do throwbacks with. Um, you know, I've done throwback videos. Used up all those. 
<laughs> all my ones from Celebration and everything. I use up all those. I can't do those anymore. Um, I do have a lot that I've recorded at work that I can't upload until after work is closed. So that could be fun. Um, I'm doing a whole video that I'm making for that. Um, I still want to do that. And I have to get more footage. That's why I want... At work, we're trying to get everything done by May 31st so I can have the entire month of June just to condense and close out the store, but also have a lot of fun and get a lot of footage. So, um, anyways. Uh, but, man, just, do you think that you could vlog every single day? Like, just imagine, like, doing that. Like, it's very difficult, and I'm glad I've made it this far, you know? And, um, what day... I guess it'd be <clears throat> three more weeks, it'd be 31st, so another, was that 40 something days? So I'll be almost at 200 by the time my store closes, right? Yeah. Um, right? Yeah, 265. Something like that. Maybe a little less. But um, yeah, it's just been, it's just difficult sometimes to do it but then at this and then on the other days it's a lot of fun because you're recording all this stuff and you know there's been the few that um that I've done before that you know are really deep videos I did my I've only done two or I've done a few like um a few that are hard for me to watch it's hard for me to watch the did YouTube kill my social life that was a hard one um and then why I don't ask for help that was another hard one uh, I'm worried about everyone else. That was a very emotional video um, where I got emotional thinking about, you know, everyone else's lives changing from my store closing. Um, the life update I just posted a few days ago was um, pretty, you know, scratching the surface of what's going on. Um, you know, like I said, I'm freaking out because I'm like, what the fuck am I doing after June 30th? But, uh, you know. I don't know, <laughs> but, uh, you know, everyone goes through situations, and you just, you know, you just gotta go through it, and, um, uh, it's difficult sometimes, but what can you do? Um, I used to, you know, there's just so many things that I think about when I look back on just the majority of the past, I consider like maybe like right before high school, like eighth grade to like now, like this is the time I like really developed as a person. So it's a time I look back a lot and uh, a lot of challenges and um, self obstacles that I went through. And um, of course, like I said, everyone has their story. Uh, I'm not unique in that regard. Like everyone goes through shit, but um, it's just, you know, it's, it's been, it's been pretty amazing just, God, this video is long, I'm sorry. It's been, it's been pretty amazing to watch the journey since January 1st in my life, um, because, you know, I consider this year, 2018, is, like, a big, like, leaning forward of, like, what's gonna be the rest of my life, and, um, it's just, uh, I just, I never thought that 2018 was gonna be a year that a, a lot of things change. Um, you know, you never know when it's going to happen, but it just happens. So, uh, I know, I know past, I've talked a lot about, um, struggling the past few months and, uh, or not the past few months, like back, the back end of 2017, uh, was just, it sucked. It was awful. And, um, I put myself through so much that, uh, I didn't need to like, cause in the end my store's closing. It doesn't matter. But, um, you know, going through all that stuff alone and just feeling like, uh, feeling like I'm saying this because it's not true, but, you know, feeling like I was doing all that stuff by myself, that no one cared, um, that I was just so alone and, um, you know, had no friends uh, at the time. You know, I, I had friends, but, you know, it's different because they all live far away. And I've talked talked about it before. I think I got emotional about it. Because I was just saying, like, you know, the majority of my friends live somewhere else in the United States, you know? North Carolina, Virginia, Ohio, um, 
wherever else everyone lives, uh, you know, they live far away. And that's how my life has been for a very long time because, you know, um, during high school I had friends, but um, I don't know the disconnect there, but, uh, you know, they just didn't. I was, I'm never the person still to invite myself to stuff. Uh, I like to be invited and included, but I don't like to push because, you know, that's just, I don't want to be that person like that puts themselves into people's plans. Um, but unfortunately with that sort of mentality, it's just, you, um, you know, you're left out a lot, a lot. And then you just, high school ended and I felt abandoned because I had no friends and uh, separated myself and you know became very independent. I've always been a very independent person as it is, but um, that sort of isolation caused a lot of sort of meltdowns and stuff between when I graduated to now and just a whole mess. But things get better because I'm starting to figure myself out and I'm just, you know, starting to see the world for what it is and figuring out what my life is going to be and that's all that matters. So I just going on a rant in here. Um, so I'm very interested to in seeing how um, the rest of this month and next month plays out. And uh, I hope everyone, everyone had a good day, I guess. Uh, I did. It was, what well, was today specifically, I just, uh, I woke up, I had, I don't know, we had Buffalo Wild Wings late last night, and then I woke up at like something, because I didn't go to bed till like three in the morning, and then I woke up again at whatever time with really bad heartburn, and I almost had like an acid attack, and my body just wanted to throw up, so I was just staying there like petrified, like if I moved, I was gonna throw up, and I just, I try everything I can do not to throw up especially these acid attacks. These acid attacks are really bad because I'm just throwing up stomach acid and then my sinuses and everything is just burning really bad. So if I can do anything to stop that, like forcing my body, like clenching up really hard and just saying, you're not throwing up, it worked. It was miserable, it hurt, it was awful, but it worked. <laughs> so um, that's what I dealt with last night and then my stomach was just weird all day today and um, you know, I I think I ate once today, and it was just a sandwich um, from Subway um, that Madison brought me because I couldn't leave my work. But and then work was pretty easy, and my source trashed. I don't know. It's just how it is. I think a big picture, not that little stuff. Um, but it was a good day. So, anyways, I hope everyone had good days. Um, I really do. You should. You shouldn't push yourself to have a good day every day because uh, life is so short I mean hell I'm 132 videos in and you know it's how it is so anyways I'm gonna go I am off tomorrow I need to clean up and do laundry and do a whole bunch of other stuff that I have going on tomorrow so hopefully it will be fun and um, I that's pretty much it. So, um, yeah. I guess I will see everyone. This video is way too long, but I don't care. This is good quality talking. I feel good. <laughs> so, anyways, we'll see everyone tomorrow. All right.